now, KITV4 Sports. I think we have some excellent uh, receivers, which normally makes you a better receiver coach. If you have really excellent receivers, that'd help you. I hope you're all having a pleasant evening. As we first reported last night, UH head football coach Greg McMackin today introduced 77-year-old Mouse Davis as a Warriors' new receivers coach, replacing Ron Lee, who resigned last month after 11 seasons at the school. Most coaches, like myself, uh, borrow from a lot of coaches and a lot of coaches' knowledge. And Mouse is truly an innovator uh, in the game of football. Mouse assisted June Jones here for three seasons, then returned to Portland State as offensive coordinator. He's widely regarded as the father of the run-and-shoot offense with success at all levels. As a head man at Portland State in the 70s, Vikings led the country in total offense six consecutive seasons in scoring 105 points once. Now, Max Masterplan has Mouse as mentor to Warriors' first-time offensive coordinator, Nick Rolovich. It would be pretty stupid of me not to use him for all his knowledge, all his history, all his stories, all his examples. That opportunity for me is, is something a lot of people would kill for, and I better take advantage of it. Now, I'm not here to reinvent the wheel. Rolo is a guy that's reinventing the wheel. I'm just helping him become a better Reinventor of the wheel. That's the deal. <laughs> Didn't have the title as OC, but Rolo handled play calling duties most of last season. And the Warriors put up some numbers. Third in the country, throwing for 337 yards per game, ranked 14th with 437 and a half yards of total offense. Brian Moniz passed for 2,390 yards, 14 touchdowns, and this guy. Greg Salas made 106 receptions for 1,590 yards, eight. TDs. You want to be aggressive as an offensive coordinator. As a player, you want to be aggressive. He's got a sickness where he's even more aggressive, isn't it? I know. I I caught a little bit of the bug, but it's it's good to have that sickness around. Football is not a game to be played to lose. What he brings is another guy who believes that we can throw the ball every down and we we can win ball games throwing the ball. So you gotta win. You gotta put wins on the board. Warriors open fall camp August 4th, game one in September 2nd versus USC. Meet 44-year-old Scott Fisher, hired by UH men's head basketball coach Gib Arnold today as director of operations. Former UC Santa Barbara hoopster, played for Australia in the 96 Olympics. He's a Hall of Famer down under as two-time MVP of the NBL. to recruit for the Rainbow Warriors and handle day-to-day -day operations. Big league brother Kurt Suzuki, 0 for 3 so far, but his age lead the Pirates right now, 5-4 in the sixth inning.